ഹലോ കെമിസ്ട്രി നീറ്റ് ട്വൻറ്റി ട്വൻറ്റി വൺ പേപ്പർ ഡിസ്കഷൻ റൈറ്റ് ഓപ്ഷൻ ഫോർ ദ നമ്പർ ഓഫ് ടെട്ര ഹെഡൽ ആൻഡ് ഡോക്ടർ ഹെഡൽ വൈഡ്സ് ഇൻ ഹെക്സാഗോണൽ പ്രിമിറ്റീവ് യൂണിറ്റ്സ് എല്ലാർ ട്വൽവ് ആൻഡ് സിക്സ് ടെട്ര ഹെഡൽ ട്വൽവ് ഒക്ടർ ഹെഡൽ സിക്സ് സിൽക്കോണിയം ആൻഡ് ഓഫ്നിയം സിമിലർ എറ്റോമിക് റേഡിയസ് ബിക്കോസ് ഓഫ് ലാൻഡ് ആൻഡ് കൺട്രാക്ഷൻ ഫോർ ഡി ടു ഫൈവ് ഡി സീരീസ് ദ റേഡിയസ് വിൽ ബി സെയിം ഇൻ ദിസ് ക്വസ്റ്റ്യൻ ഫിഫ്റ്റി തേർഡ് For a reaction, A to B enthalpy of reaction is minus 4.2. That means delta H is negative. When delta H is negative, that is exothermic reaction. So, energy of reactant should be more than products. In this paper, it is second option. You can see on the screen. Tritium, a radioactive isotope of hydrogen, emits which of the following particles? Beta particles. Statement of NCRT. RBC deficiency is a deficiency disease of vitamin B12. The molar conductance of sodium chloride, hydrogen chloride and sodium acetate at infinite dilution are 126.45, 426.16 and 91.0 semen centimeter square per mole respectively the molar conductance of acetic acid at infinite dilution is. Choose the right option for your answer. This is based on the Kohlrausch law. It is like this. Acetic acid is equal to sodium acetate plus HCl minus NaCl. It is equal to 390.71 Kohlrausch law. ഫിഫ്റ്റി സെവൻത് വൺ ദ കറക്റ്റ് സ്ട്രക്ചർ ഓഫ് ടു സിക്സ് ഡൈമിത്തൈൽ ഡെക് ഫോർ ഇൻ ഹിയർ യു ക്യാൻ സി ദ ഫസ്റ്റ് ഓപ്ഷൻ ഫോർത്ത് പ്ലേസ് ഡബിൾ ബോണ്ട് ഇസ് ദർ സെക്കൻഡ് ആൻഡ് സിക്സ് പ്ലേസ് മിത്തൈൽ ഇറ്റ്സ് എൻ ഈസി ക്വസ്റ്റൻ ദ മാക്സിമം ടെമ്പറേച്ചർ ദാറ്റ് ക്യാൻ ബി അച്ചീവ്ഡ് ഇൻ ബ്ലാസ്റ്റ് ഫർണേസിസ് അപ് ടു ടു തൗസൻഡ് ടു ഹൺഡ്രഡ് കെൽവിൻ ഇറ്റ് ഇസ് അഗൻ എൻ സി ആർ ടി സ്റ്റേറ്റ്മെൻറ് ടൈപ്പ് ക്വസ്റ്റൻ ഐഡൻറ്റിഫൈ ദ കോമ്പൗണ്ട് ദാറ്റ് വിൽ റിയാക്ട് വിത്ത് ഹിൻസ്ബർഗ് റിയജൻറ്റ് ടു ഗീവ് എ സോളിഡ് വിച്ച് ഡിസോൾസ് ഇൻ ആൽക്കലി ഈസ് ഇറ്റ്സ് പ്രൈമറി അമൈൻ പ്രൈമറി അമൈൻ മീൻസ് എൻ എച്ച് ടു ഗ്രൂപ്പ് സോ ഓപ്ഷൻ ത്രീ The following solutions were prepared by dissolving 10 grams of glucose, urea and sucrose in 250 ml water. The right option, the osmotic pressure. Osmotic pressure is inversely proportional to molecular mass. So, urea molecular mass is less, that is 60. Glucose 180, sucrose 342. Pi is equal to CRT, you can remember this formula. Pi is equal to CRT, C is molarity. That means pi is proportional to 1 by molecular mass. Glucose molecular mass is 180, urea is 60 and sucrose is 342. So here the correct option is first option P2, P1, P3. Urea, glucose, then sucrose. 60 first question. Major product HBr peroxide. HBr peroxide means anti-marconic of addition. Here first option you can see, anti-marconic of addition. Given below statements, aspirin and paracetamol, narcotic, morphine and heroin, non-narcotic, both are reverse given. Aspirin, paracetamol, non-narcotic, morphine, heroin are narcotic. So both statements are wrong. Both statements are false. The correct sequence of bond enthalpy of CX bond, Carbon fluorine bond is stronger than carbon chlorine, carbon bromine, carbon iodine. So, second option. BF3 is planar. So, sp2 hybridization. And number of electrons, 3 electrons from boron, 3 electrons from fluorine. So, number of electrons will be 6. So, the number of electrons around the central atom will be 6 and hybridization is sp2. sp2 and 6. 65th question. Which one of the following is the correct answer? option for right relationship between cp and cv direct question cp minus cv is equal to r easiest question among the following alkaline earth metal halides the one which is covalent beryllium chloride becl2 an organic compound contains 78 percent by weight of carbon and remaining percentage is hydrogen the right option for the empirical formula it is slight controversy may be there in this because carbon 78 percent means hydrogen 22 percent So, number of moles calculation 78 by 12. This is 22 by 1. 78, 12 by 12, 6 is 72. So, 6.5 it will be. And this is 22. So, getting the least number 6.5 by 6.5 is equal to 1. And 22 by 6.5 is approximately 3. So, CH3. But here the problem is. Carbon, if it is 75%, hydrogen 25%, the answer will come CH4. 
carbon 80 percentage hydrogen 20 percentage the answer will come ch3 here it is given carbon 78 percentage but of course ch3 is the correct answer according to my knowledge the major product formed in dehydrohalogenation reaction of 2 bromopentane is pentoene pentoene not pentoenine pentoene is sergeff rule if it is pentoenine that is halfmans so here the correct key is 1 what is the IUPAC name of the organic compound formed in the chemical reaction? Acetone, when reacts with C2H5MGBr, the reaction will be like this. It is acetone, when treated with C2H5MGBr, then followed by water, the reaction will be like this. It will become OH. So, number of carbons will be 1, 2, 3, 4. So, second place methyl, second place OH. So 2-methyl-2-butanol is the answer. 2-methyl-butane-2-ol, that will be the answer. Noble gases are named because of their inertness towards reactivity. Identify the inner incorrect statement about them. Noble gases. Gases should not have high melting and boiling points. So second option. The PKB of dimethylamine and PKA of acetic acid are 3.27, 4.77 respectively. The correct option for the pH. It's a weak acid, weak base salt. Further the formula is pH is equal to 7 plus of pKa minus of pKb. 7 plus 1 by 2. pKa value is given as 3.27. PK is given. Half into PKB and PKA. PKA is given 4.77 minus of PKB. PKB is given 3.27. On solving this, you will get 7.75. So 7.75 third option. The right option for the statement Tyndall effect is exhibited by colloidal solution, start solution. Acid strength increases in the order given HF, HCl, HBr, HI true statements because the bond energy is less. Uh, as the size of the elements FCl, BRI increases down the group, the bond strength decreases. So both statements are correct statements. Ethylene diamine tetraestate is hexadentatligan, you know the structure of this. CH2, CH2, N, N. So this will be having CH2, COO minus CH2, COO minus EDTA minus 4. So you can see here two lone pairs from nitrogens, then four from oxygens. So hexadentate ligand with 4 oxygen and 2 N donor atoms. First option is the right option. Choose the correct option for the graphical representation of Boyle's law. This is one interesting one. But you are very lucky because two options are there. From the two options you can easily check one. See, when you are taking P versus V graph, rectangular hyperbola will be there. But as you are moving up, if this is T1, this is T2, this is T3. T3 greater than T2 greater than T1. So here the right option is in this this is the right option graph. 600k should be high at top then 400 then 200. The structure of beryllium chloride in solid state and in vapor state is in beryllium chloride it will be chain and in the vapor state it will be dimer and above 1200 Kelvin it will be a linear molecule chain and dimer correct option ncrt which one of the following methods can be used to obtain highly pure metal which is liquid at room temperature distillation for liquids uh, low boiling liquids like zinc and mercury we use distillation the compound which shows metamerism that is c4h10o c4h10o methyl 
C3H7, C2H5, O C2H5. So C4H10 O can show metamerism. Metamers are those compounds which have same functional group but different alkyl groups attached. So here the right option is C4H10O. The correct option for the number of body centered unit cells in all 14 types of Bravais lattices unit cells will be 3. You can check it from NCRT solid states out of 14 types of Bravais lattices you will be getting 3 body centered unit cells. Which one of the following polymers is prepared by addition polymerization that is simple Teflon CF2. CF2 double bond CF2 this gives you CF2 single bond CF2 it is Teflon addition polymerization a particular station of all India radio New Delhi broadcasts on a frequency of 1368 kHz the wavelength of the electromagnetic radiation So wavelength purpose we have one simple calculation lambda is equal to c by nu c is 3 into 10 to the power of 8 meters per second given and nu is given as 1368 kilo h 1368 into 10 to the power of 3 h so this is nothing but 3 into 10 to the power of 5 by 1368 so if you are taking exact value that will come 219.29 219.29 is 219.3 but here the biggest um, trouble for the students is the one option is given as 219.2 219.2 is also given this is a problem for the students the answer will come 219.29 it is NCRT example book example question 219.3 is the right answer 219.2 is very close value let us see which of the following reactions is the metal displacement reaction direct question cr2o3 plus 2al al2o3 plus 2cr the incorrect statement among the following is most of the trivalent lanthanide ions are colored 83rd second option ncr direct statement question Dihedral angle of least stable conformer. Least stable conformer means one behind another. So, 0 degree. Least stable 0 degree. 85. PCL5 is trigonal bipyramidal. SF6 is octahedral. BRF5 is square pyramidal. BF3 is trigonal planar. PCL5 trigonal bipyramidal. So, A should be 4. Then SF6 square pyramidal. B should be 3. BRFI is square pyramidal so C should be 1 so option 1 so this is 86th question 87th is sorry 85th question 86th is CH3 CH2 COO NA when that is treated with NaOH and CAO that is soda lime direct question easy question 86th question is easy 87th the intermediate compound X in the following chemical reaction is this is etal reaction. In etal reaction, the intermediate is first option you can see clearly in NCRT also it is given, and even also by seeing here also you can easily say because that is the only option given with chromium. Okay, then 88th question match list 1 with list 2. Here C you can see CaCO3 plus H2SO4 is acid rain. From this you can easily say the remaining. Okay, now C must be 1. C1 option is only given third. Okay, A4, SO2 plus O2 gives us SO3, tropospheric pollution. And B3, HOCl giving you free radicals, they can deplete ozone. Then D2, NO2 is giving you NO and O. NO and O will be forming smog. 89, uh, first benzene with COHCl is Gatterman coach RCOCH3 NaOx is halophone reaction RCH2OH plus acid is esterification RCH2COH is hell whole hard Jelinski reaction ok 89 A should be with second option A2 A2 is only fourth option 
so many matching questions are given this time match list 1 with list 2 f is n6 minus 3 this question i think you need some explanation in detail explanation i will give you one see here f e c n6 minus 3 means iron is in plus 3 oxidation state but cyanide is a strong field ligand when it is strong field ligand this iron plus 3 configuration will be 4s 0 3d5 3d5 means like this 1 2 3 4 5 electrons we are expecting but in octahedral complexes when it is going like this when cyanide is a strong field ligand 1 2 3 4 5 only one unpaired electron will be remaining when one unpaired electron is there the magnetic momentum will be 1.73 board magnetons fecn6 minus 3 similarly fecn6 minus 4 if you see fecn6 minus 4 means iron will be in the plus 2 oxidation state 4s 0 3d6 so when it is 4s 0 3d6 eg and t2g orbitals all will be here so no unpaired electrons even d6 is there no unpaired electrons are there so magnetic momentum will be zero bore magnetons fe h2o taken six if you see with the plus three configuration so iron plus three iron plus three means four is zero three d5 four is zero three d5 means you will be having five unpaired electrons as water is weak field ligand five unpaired electrons so mu is equal to 5.9 bore magnetons when it is given FeH2O taken 6 plus 2 iron plus 2 oxidation state 4s0 3d6 water is weak field ligand so when you are filling 1 2 3 4 5 6 there are 4 unpaired electrons so it will be having 4.9 bore magnetons so the right option will be FeCn6 minus 4 will be 0 FECN6 minus 3 will be 1.73. If you check like that, you can get the answer directly. FECN6 minus 4 is 0. C must be 2. C2 only one option is given, that is last option. The reagent or in the given sequence of chemical reaction is first step is diazotization. Then N2 plus C R minus can be removed by using H3PO2 or ethyl alcohol. So here H3PO2 option is not given, so you can go with ethyl alcohol. 91 option 2. 92 is the product formed in the following chemical reaction is it is NaBH4C2H5OH it won't affect ester but it reduces ketone to alcohol it won't affect ester it won't affect ester so fourth option ketone to alcohol ester is as it is this structure you can see this is your answer from the following pairs of ions which one is not an isoelectronic pair it's an easy question from period table isoelectronic pair means number of electrons should be same so that cannot be same in case of fe plus 2 mn plus 2 because two different atoms with same oxidation state can never be isoelectronic fe plus 2 mn plus 2 if you want explanation i will give you fe plus 2 mn plus 2 iron atomic number 26 2 electrons gone so 24 Manganese 25, 2 electrons gone, so 23. They can never be isoelectronic. The molar conductivity of 0 0.007 M acetic acid is 20 Siemens centimeter square per mole. What is the dissociation constant of acetic acid? Choose the correct option. See here, for H plus it is given 350, for acetate it is given 50. So, lambda infinity of the compound is 350 plus 50 is 400 but lambda c is given as 20 okay now in the applications of cold rush law alpha is equal to lambda c by lambda infinity that is 20 by 400 1 by 20 and the formula you know ka is equal to c alpha square for weak acids C is given 0 0.007 into 1 by 20 square that is equals to 1.75 10 to the power of minus 5. You can check this in 1.75 10 to the power of minus 5 will come.
good question it is but based on cold rasla there are two questions of course it is related to even ka also choose the correct option for the total pressure in atma in a mixture of 4 grams of oxygen 2 grams of hydrogen see number of moles of hydrogen is equal to 2 by 2 is equal to 1 number of moles of oxygen is equal to 4 grams by 32 that is 1 by 8 that is equal to 0.125 so total number of moles are 1.125 then pressure is equal to n rt by v 1.125 into 0.0821 into temperature 273 by volume 1 liter is equals to 25.18 into 0.082 by 273 by 1 is 25.18 atmospheres the correct option for the value of vapor pressure of a solution at 45 degree celsius with benzene to octane in molar ratio of 3 is to 2 yes this question can be answered like this here you can see benzene and octane both are given benzene to octane are given 3 is to 2 so total number of moles are 5 moles so mole fraction of benzene is 3 by 5 mole fraction of octane is 2 by 5 so total pressure p total is equal to raul's law P not A X A plus P not B X B X is here chi P not A chi A P not B chi B that is um, for benzene it is given 280 280 into 3 by 5 plus for octane it is given 420 420 into 2 by 5 which is equals to 336 both 168 total is equal to 336 option 3 336 mm for irreversible expansion of an ideal gas under isothermal conditions the correct option is delta u is equals to 0 delta s total is not equal to 0 okay now but when this kind of questions are there in choice i think for neat students these kind of questions may give you some confusion you can comfortably leave this but if you are um okay with thermodynamics then you can answer this which of the following molecules is non polar in nature sbcl5 no lone pairs and central atom pocl3 different atoms attached ch2o different atoms attached nitrogen different atoms and lone pair one unpaired atom overall system they are all polar sbcl5 is non polar 99 option 2 you see H2O to H2S, H2S to H2SC, H2S H2 TE. The acidic nature will be increasing. So Ka increases, pKa decreases. So option two is incorrect statement. Sequence is not strictly not strict means incorrect. Incorrect is second option. The slope of arrhenius plot, ln K versus one by T of first order reaction is minus five into ten to the power of three. Then He is asking choose the right option. So the formula is very simple. Slope is minus E A by R. Slope is given minus five into ten to the power of three is equal to minus E A by R. R value given eight point three one four joule. So minus minus cancel. R is E A is equal to forty one point five kilo joules. It is joules. Here ten to the power of three is there. so that can convert into kilojoules so that's all for chemistry overall what i can say one simple review is not a very easy paper at the same time not very tough but uh, as five questions are choice are there those who are weak in physical chemistry you can comfortably skip those who are weak in organic chemistry you can comfortably skip almost maintain balance and all types of questions are covered ncert statements are also there more matching type of questions are given fine paper let us see how many students will get 180 all the very best for all those um, those who have written the exam let's hope for the best scores good luck